down full with two. He's going to the wall here. Solid nice. half life. Oh, hit him with the kidney stone. Alright, he's gonna punch the ground now. Nope. Right, I'm gonna go, go low. low. Nice. Nice. Knew about the duck. Round two. Very, very seamless first round there. Ooh, nice. Nice. Parry. Parry the dick jab. Very intuitive. Are oh, we getting some wall there? Indeed. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh him up. Check the grab. to break the falling rain. There we go. We got keep a in bit mind. Of spacing going on. Uh, Kobe. Axel is playing in my Korean stick, so I don't know. I don't know how he's doing right now. I feel like his hand must hurt. Yeah, it's a slight <laughs> handicap. Not really used to his own equipment. I feel like we might have a more Fun. mentally comfortable Axel. I believe that he can pretty much play with anything if he wants to, but, you know, you're always going to feel at home with the stuff that you usually use. You know, of all the times I've been here, I haven't seen Duan with his cereal a lot. This isn't a part of our usual stage rotation. It feels weird. It's actually really not. Now that I think about it, the usual stages I'm seeing are... Uh, Arctic Snowfall, Volcano... And Forgotten Realm, for some reason, always manages to find its way into our stream matches. The chaos will always... Whenever I go here, I feel like I'm playing the same stages. I feel like I get underrepresented in my picks. I get Pretty super unlucky. Much. Very nice down forward two. Caught him trying to get in. Uh, we get into the wall. Got yes, to the wall. Indeed. Nice. Scoops. Oh, what's he trying to do? Plus frames. Right, with the low, guaranteed throw. Stand up. Nice, Jake, and didn't duck the last hit. Therefore, it's safe. I got a little space. He's definitely oh, getting away from the wall, two. but I think he might be going back to the wall at this point. Oh, Ooh, nice parry. parry there. Nicely done. Parry on wake up is such a good option. Uh, and with the wall uh, bounce, uh, definitely uh, getting uh, some uh, solid damage out of that. Nice. Well done. Orbital, down two. They get the punish. Yep. Now die. Ooh, that's no, going to hurt. It. That was a very good attempt. Mm -hmm. But got a stage select, but no character select. Weird. Mm. At this point, I feel like for Axel, Geese is probably going to be his best option. I wouldn't see him picking anyone else, really. As you said, Geese is really going to be his best option by yeah. far. Yeah. So I he mean, doesn't really have too much else. If he does go with the Lee, uh, he can wing it. I feel like he, he can, can definitely still bring the same fight, but I feel like Geese is going to be his knight. I feel like nobody... In addition to the fact that he's already not really on his own um, controller, so he doesn't he feel play the most comfortable. <laughs> so I would definitely say at least keep the consistency. You don't want to switch too yeah. much. 1-0, Commander. Personally, I feel like Lee's less known than Geese in terms of like matchups. There's not a lot of people playing him. I would definitely say so. I've labbed pretty much every DLC character. And there's some characters in the game that were pre-existing that I just haven't touched. Eliza, I'll be honest. I haven't touched that one. I still struggle with that. You've got your Shaheen scraps. Quick intermission there, Soul Commentary. Nice break of the two throw, but with a nice punish there. Got a bit of a life lead, but some rage. Alright, just takes it very clean. That's 1 0 Commanda here. Axel still trying to put up a fight. Alright, nice with punish there. Ooh, there goes the forward two. Do not with punish, please. With the reset, that's gonna smart a bit. Does he get the wall? Does get the wall. I went for the down two, blocked it, but no punish there. We got a little bit of space and wall. Alright, nice whiff punish. Got some rage drive going there. Ooh, very nice sidestep. But dropped the combo. Has a one more chance. But gets caught ducking with the forward two. Round three. And it's going to be match point for Commander. Just barely misses, but <laughs> gets the fruits of his labor with a quick parry there. Keeping him right at the wall where he wants them. Very space controlling. Kidney stones right into the wall. Alright, manages to catch him slipping a little bit. He's going to go for a ride to the other side. Alright, nicely done. 
I trying to punish him? Nothing there. With a trade, that's going to be a 3-0 for Commando. So to anybody who's watching me, tech and stream here, or anybody who has pretty much played against Commando, I apologize for bringing him here. But everybody's got to learn. Everybody's got to learn, man. Listen, I suffered. Now you got to suffer. How 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 you gonna get good if you don't get body? Listen, man. I've never. T I'll be real with you. I have never sat down and labbed Eliza. I've just never done it. That's one of the few characters I've just ignored. I'll be entirely honest. That is a character I have avoided. Eliza, don't feel the need. Rarely does anyone ever play her. And I had a basic knowledge of her. But then I'll actually eventually sit down and learn her because there's a lot of characters in this game. List of characters that I've really not touched in terms of character knowledge. Eliza, definitely one of them. I'm gonna go with Shaheen. Although Shaheen's a very fundamental basic character, so you kinda just have to be patient with him. Ana is one of the matchups that you just really need to learn. Because they would destroy you. <laughs> <laughs> Now at this moment, let me take a look at the bracket. It looks like Slick is facing Commando next. Oh boy, big boy Slick. Big big boy Slick. Oh, this should be a good one. <laughs>